y'all, we're going to go ahead and make an easy crawfish etouffee. This is something that when you can come home, you can throw it together quick and easy and not a lot of work. So normally I would make a roux and stuff like that, but we're going to do it a little bit different. So we're going to start off with one stick and a half a stick of butter. So one and a half sticks of butter. All right, y'all. Now we are going to add in one large onion. One bell pepper. Okay. And then we are going to cook these until softened. You're going to need about a tablespoon of fresh garlic. And you want some green onions. About four of those. But I'm going to start wilting these ones down before I add in the garlic and the green onions. After about five minutes, we're gonna go ahead and add in our garlic. And I wanna use about a tablespoon. Use as much or as little as you like. Then we're gonna get ready to add in our green onions. I'm gonna give this another two minutes. Now let's go ahead and add in our green onions. And we're going to mix that around and that's about four of them all right now we're going to need two bags of louisiana crawfish tails so two 12 ounce bags of these and we're going to open these up dump it in juice and all all right y'all so let's go ahead and mix this around all right now we're going to add in a quarter cup of worcestershire sauce Let's add in one teaspoon of parsley flakes. And now I'm gonna use Big Al Sauce Company. Um, it's called That Magic Black. So it's like a blackening seasoning. You can use whatever Cajun seasoning you want. Um, about one to two tablespoons. This is low salt, so you know, it, you don't have to watch too much of your salt level. So I'm going to add in two tablespoons. And we're going to mix this around. Now we're going to add in one tablespoon of prepared yellow mustard. I'm going to eyeball that. Okay. Let's mix that around. Now we're going to add in one can of diced tomatoes with green chilies. And we're gonna add in one can of cream of mushroom. So let's add that in here. And then we're gonna mix this together. We're gonna add in some water about two cups of water. All right, so we're gonna cook this down until the water is kind of evaporated and you got a thick gravy. Give that about 20 minutes. So I'll see you back here then. All right, y'all, so it's been simmering for about 30 minutes. We got some rice and we're gonna pour this over top and this is what we're gonna have for dinner tonight. So give this a try. If anybody has any comments, questions, or concerns, don't hesitate to reach out. Remember to please like and share. The Big Al Sauce Company, I will put his link in the comments. You got to check them out. They're great. They got hot sauce. Um, I know Bruce Mitchell also sponsors him. So give this a try. The cookbook link will be above this post and in the comments. And I hope everybody has a wonderful day.